Hi guys, welcome back to Spud Run Golf. Man, this channel has been on fire. I'm telling you what, in the last three or four days, Spud Run Golf has went crazy. I know you're new here, probably new here, because we had a ton of new subscribers, ton of new viewers. Guys, thanks so much. It's awesome seeing all the comments, seeing where everybody's from. So do me a solid in the comments, tell me where you're from. I'd love to hear. I'll go first. I'm from Southern Ohio here in the US of A at my backyard golf hole. In today's episode, we're gonna play number one hole. It's a par four, it's about 310 to the hole today. Little bit of wind, not too much. We got all kinds of trouble up there though. We got a creek, we got a grass bunker by the green. Tons of trouble. The most important thing about today's video, this episode, you're gonna find out if I've got an opportunity to play Augusta National, if I've got an opportunity to drive down Magnolia Lane, to just stripe it down Amen's Corner. I know I could. But we're gonna find out in today's episode, me and my buddies, I'll explain that more in a little bit. I'll talk about that as we're going to our second shot today. We need to get started. We're losing daylight here at Spud Run Golf. Let's get started on this first tee, and we'll go over how and when and if I can go to Augusta National. Let's tee it up. I guess before we tee it up, we've got to see where the golf clubs are at. That's the good news about having your backyard golf hole. Amongst all your toys and junk, you just find your golf clubs in your shop or garage, and then you go tee it up. Whoa! <laughs> That's my golf cart buggy. She's a beaut. All right, guys, we got a three wood. Pro V1, Titleist 4, hard in the golf attire. I've got a backyard golf hole, not a PGA Tour card. The three wood because I don't want to hit in the creek. If we was playing a scramble, I'd probably hit driver. Go for the 310. We've got a camera in the fairway, drone in the air. It'd be nice if I just land this right by that camera. Give me about 100 yards in. Oh, it's going for the camera. That's going to hit the camera, guys. Perfect. I mean perfect. All right, guys, we're off to hit the first tee shot. You probably noticed on that drone flight, I just reseeded and extended this fairway. You have to go check that video out. Right now we have seven tee boxes and they're all fairly new and we're driving through the new fairway part, which like I said, is it's coming in well. I hate to actually be driving on it right now, but for this video purpose, we're gonna drive on it. Now, once I get up and address this shot, I'm gonna tell you guys more about the Augusta trip, okay? Man, that, that ball was perfect. Perfect. All right, spud under golf, we can roll it. But here's the deal, guys. A good friend of mine, we golf all the time together, and we're ornery, but we go all over. We go all over the country golfing at least once a year, maybe twice a year. So Grady, my buddy, has got an opportunity to take one person to Augusta National, and he chose between me and Seth. Now, to make it fair, we're going to flip a quarter. And that's what we're going to do here at the end of this video. We're going to flip that quarter. Now, I will warn you, we cuss. We're, we're drinking beer, we're doing everything that, if you got kids watching, they probably shouldn't watch this. We're just, we're, we're just guys in our element, in our little shop, talking about golf, and we get real ornery. So stay tuned for the end to see if I get to go to Augusta National. But first, let's put this baby tight. Shot number two, I am, uh, let's see, I'm 75 yards. I've got my tight list, 60 degree. Just gonna be a little punch. A little punch. Man, I've never had this many people watching me. There's probably gonna be like 300 people watching this video. Hillbilly in Southern Ohio. Here we go. And I'm short. I've got a super long putt, but at least I'm putting. Birdie putt, this green's 1800 square foot. Wish I would've made it bigger, I really do. It takes about the same effort to fertilize it and treat it and mow it, whether it be, you know, 1,800 square foot or probably 2,800 square foot. So if I had to do it over again, I probably made it bigger. But it's, uh, I still might make it bigger one of these days. Maybe next year. It's just now starting to really grow in. Things are looking good. As we come up to our wide oak bridge we made, I actually think we had a video about that too. Check that video out if you have it. All right, guys, I thought I was putting, but I'm actually chipping. So we're gonna have to get, ah, uh, I'll probably get the sand wedge on that. All right, you hacks, this is shot number three here at the par four, short of the green. Gotta get this up and down so I don't embarrass myself on the first ever preview of my golf game on Spud Run Golf. Here we go. Oh yeah, get in the hole, <laughs> a little bit short. I sure hope I don't get a bogey. Well, I really wanted to sink a birdie for you guys. I think that's a gimme, but I'm gonna go ahead and put it out so we can hear the ball drop in the cup. For the first time here at Spud Run Golf, if you like what you're seeing, make sure you hit that like button. That really helps the channel grow. And like I said, the channel is on fire right now. So we're gonna to try to pounce 
on this momentum we got. So let's drain this putt, hear the ball drop, and then let's go to the coin flip for Augusta National. Green's a mess. All these trees around. See, my, me and my buddies, actually that wouldn't be good with me and my buddies. It's outside the club, even with money. Par. I know one thing's for certain. I need a cameraman. Anybody want to cameraman me? Playing golf's one thing. Flying the drone, moving cameras. Hope you guys love it. Actually, it was fun. This is probably the most fun video I've made so far. We've got an opportunity to go to Augusta National Golf Course and play golf. My buddy, and there's a story I'll tell us later, but one of my buddies got a chance to take one other buddy down. So it's between me and Seth. You're gonna meet him in a minute. We're gonna flip a quarter. We're gonna do the best of seven to see who wins and gets the opportunity to go down to Augusta to play golf. Biggest flip of my life. It's it's not good. 20. So All right, it's almost 920. The deed is getting ready to go down right saying, now. Augusta National, here we come. Yeah. Coming on. That's the chance, this is the table. First one to seven win. Up in the air. You got to call it in the air. Maybe here we go, first one. And game one goes to three iron. Heads. Tails. Oh. Oh. Two of. Sure. Heads. Oh. This could be a first, this yep. could be the 1990 Reds. Beat the Oakland A's. Three of. Here we go, Randy. Heads. Heads. I'm back. Oh! On the board. He wins at home. Three to one. Coming back. On the board. Randy, your turn. Oh, that okay. oh my goodness. Gee, buddy, that looked like he's pitching wedge. Randy, I want to read you completely. Randy, that's like his putter. There we go. <laughs> Tails! Oh, oh, uh -oh. Three, two. Three, two. three, two, down to two games. Okay, yeah. here we go, ready? For the tie. For the tie. I'm going ahead. Game go. seven. Heads, I'm going go. Go heads. Heads! Heads! Oh, it's oh, going to game seven! Game seven! Game seven! Game seven! Game seven. Yeah. We need a TV. Yes. We need a TV. Oh! Game is roll. Table, Grady's out. Grady's yeah. out. Remember that. Back in our bags. Remember that. All right. And Seth Cole's in the air. In the air. Ready? Ten four. He's got a in the air. Three, two, one. Hits. Oh, not a bad. It's a head. Look at that. Might as well turn all that shit off. Turn the shit off now. Here we go. All right, everybody jump around now. Uh -oh. Jump, 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 jump around. Bye. 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 Hey. So, dang on it, guys. I did not win the opportunity to go to Augusta National. But that's okay. There's a couple other options that might pop up. I'm not giving up hope, but man, that stung. Uh, I'm glad my buddies are getting to go though. It's obviously a trip once in a lifetime. Somebody commented before that there are opportunities you can go if you get on caddy. Doubt I'd ever have the time to, to go down to caddy for several months to get the opportunity to play. Well, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm not always going to be cussing and carrying on with my friends like that. But for us, it's part of what we do golfing. And we go on golf trips, we just give each other all kinds of heck. And that's what it's all about. We have fun. And I hope you guys have fun with your buddies like that also. If you haven't yet, hit that like button. Comment where you're from, please. If you subscribe, turn that bell on so you won't miss any episodes here from Spud Run Golf. So thanks for watching. Thanks for playing with the Spud Run Golf over and out.